welcome to Shop Talk with Cassandra Renee. With me are my co-hosts, Kevin Eaton. Good morning, Baltimore. And Angelo Superstar, Baba Richardson. Good morning. Hey, good morning, fellas. Good morning. How, how you doing? Doing great. Oh, my gosh. Doing great. You know, I did not drink anything Saturday but water, but I feel so hungover. Really? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I feel so hungover. Yeah, that's because you was working really, really hard to get that event off the ground, Kazo. Yes, and mm -hmm. and all we like to say is congratulations to you, you know, with your show. And you've been here a year and yes. you had a nice celebration. And um, hey, you're doing it. Woman of power. Woman of power. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to do my thing. But yeah. you know what? I cannot do my thing without my two co hosts, <laughs> Mr. Kevin and Mr. Angelo. Angelo was the chef of the evening. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, were people raving over that food? Mm -hmm. You did your thing, man. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, was, I was making sure we had enough. Oh my like, gosh. I was nervous. Oh, you did really well. Yeah. You know, because we had a VIP room and mm -hmm. there was salmon in there and mm -hmm. all sorts of special dishes mm -hmm. and everything was just so beautiful. Mm -hmm. And the yeah. funny part of me, to me, was when Angelo was trying to tell people, I'm not a caterer, I'm a barber. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I got like three catering jobs. <laughs> I was like, I, I cut here. I, yeah, I here. You weren't even trying to get business. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. You know, but it was. I mean, being that we worked hard. We worked yeah. for three months mm -hmm. getting this event together. It changed so many times. Mm -hmm. And, yeah. you know, to the people who stuck in there with us and supported us and the volunteers mm -hmm. and the family members and all the guests, thank you, thank you, mm -hmm. thank you for the, from the bottoms of mm -hmm. our, our hearts. Because we, it wouldn't have come to fruition if it mm -hmm. wasn't for you. Mm -hmm. right. Those of you who missed it, ha-ha, <laughs> you missed some good stuff, y'all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. We just want our listeners to know exactly what we are talking about, because some of them may not oh, know what we are talking you're about. You're right, Kevin. Let's go yeah, back. We are talking about the annual event that we had over the weekend to pretty much commemorate us being on the air for one year. Yes. And we invited the whole world to come. The whole world. <laughs> <laughs> and it was a very lovely event. I think half the world showed up. Mm -hmm. We we oversold Double VIPs. Double half snuck through the back door. <laughs> we oversold General. We just oversold. It mm -hmm. was standing room mm -hmm. only. Thank you so much Thank for you supporting very much. us. Mm -hmm. Thank our listeners, our supporters. Mm -hmm. You know everyone who puts in. You know to our to our efforts and our show and backing my cousin over here. Thank you. Yeah, it was an elegant mm -hmm. event though. Mm-hmm. You know, and I did the alter ego thing. Okay. <laughs> alter ego diva thing. You know, because I started out with this silver sparkly dress you know with my little silver shoes and my mm -hmm. long hair mm -hmm. and then halfway through i had this short sassy haircut with this black right. gown with a plunging mm -hmm. neckline mm -hmm. after seven look mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. way after seven baby <laughs> <laughs> on the line we have julie hi julie hi how are you good 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 julie is actually the manager of little larry Oh, yeah. Oh, little Michael Jackson, huh? Little Michael That's Jackson. That's my man. Well, he made my night. Well, he came out there. Great. I was, he was like, fabulous. Oh, man, she would cover all the bases. We're going to have to get an interview with little Larry. He's in school right now, right? <laughs> that boy we bad. Yes. That boy bad. So tell us about little Larry briefly, Julie. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make a confession right here. I'm one of those cats that's got uh, Michael Jackson-itis. Uh -oh. If I don't hear Michael Jackson for a while, I got to turn it on and get the twitching and stuff like that. But when that oh, boy no, came out there, boy, that Michael Jackson itis came out of me, boy. Ooh. I was ready to beat it myself out there. Wonderful. I'm telling you, he did great. Thank did you, great. Julie, for calling in. Thank you so much for having me. All right, bye-bye. Right. On the line, we have Harriet. Hi, Harriet. Good morning. Thank you so much. Harriet was actually one of our event coordinators, and she's Simone's mom. We have Charmaine. Hi, Charmaine. Hi, Sandra. Hey. Good. How are you doing? Good. So you were actually our featured artist. Yes, I was. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Because you actually had two paintings. You had one of a beautiful woman with a purple background mm -hmm. uh, in honor of the lupus. Uh, right. Yes, because the color is purple. She had this gorgeous hat and, oh my gosh, the features on this woman's face. So many people were interested in that painting. It was incredible. 
on the line we have Miss Takia. Hi, Takia. Hello, hello. How are you? Hey, are girl. You? <laughs> the question is, how are you? Takia was actually our makeup artist. She was the head makeup artist, so she actually coordinated that effort. Right. Yes, yes. It was, so it was fabulous. That fashion show was fabulous. It was. Oh, that it fashion was. show was like no other. I mean, you don't see that in Baltimore, in the Baltimore area at all. No, it was very elegant. Very uh -huh. elegant. It was it was elegant, but it had some sass in it too. Yeah. Of course. It had some, <laughs> what, what were you gonna say, Angela? And, and the meatballs gave her life, is what she told me. Oh, the meatballs gave you life, Takia. <laughs> <laughs> I was meatballs. wondering why every time I saw her, she still had meatballs on the plate. I was like, man, if she ate them, why she still got meatballs on the plate? <laughs> oh, you would love it. Did you have the two different flavors or was mm -hmm. it one? It was two. It was pineapple bourbon and then just strictly Hawaiian. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what I had, but... <laughs> <laughs> that food was excellent. Yeah. I mean, because of all the excitement, mm -hmm. I couldn't eat the way I wanted to, right. but what I tasted was just, I mean, seasoned to perfection. Right, right Takia? Yeah. It was over. Over. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, peeking around the corner, I'm like, <laughs> that, that was so funny, because I went into the bathroom. Uh, when, I, when I actually went into the bathroom, I had on the silver, and I had mm -hmm. my long hair and my little silver shoes, right? And Takia was actually seated right, right outside there. the bathroom. Yeah. So waiting for me to come out because she was going to change my makeup look because I went from like a nude natural look to something a little bit sexier so she was waiting for me to come out and I come out and I had my little you know short hair on and the first thing I did was I turned my head around the corner looking for Jaleesa right. who was our hairstylist from mm -hmm. Afrolistics right. and I'm looking for Jaleesa because I wanted to make sure everything was straight because right, she like, even said she didn't know because I was like Jaleesa I said come here Jaleesa and she looked at me like uh oh -uh, I don't I know, know you, you. <laughs> and then she said Cassandra <laughs> and then she came running in the bathroom right. with me. And I look like, that was Cassandra. <laughs> she did. <laughs> and, and my whole personality changed too, didn't All it? <laughs> On the line, we have Keisha. Hi, dear. Hi, Cassandra. Good. How are you? Keisha was actually a vendor. She has a jewelry business. Okay, I remember her table. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, t tell us actually, about. Your I actually Keisha. saw your table from a distance. Um, so I did not have the opportunity to see it up close and personal and I just want everybody to know that I will be actually purchasing, purchasing a piece from Keisha because what I saw from a distance was beautiful. So I can only imagine what I would have seen if I had the opportunity to see it up close and personal. Right. So, you know, yeah, so very, very well because mm -hmm. Simone's pieces were the first pieces that came out. Yes, they were. Beautiful. So Simone, would you give your contact information? Help me out because I had a slight a wardrobe malfunction. So thank you for helping me with that, dear. <laughs> have have a great day. All right, you too. All right, bye bye. On the line we have Pamela. Hi, Pamela. Good morning. Good morning. Hey. Mm hmm. So why did you have me in that Soul Train line? Girl, I was in pain all day Sunday. On the air we have Kiana. Kiana was actually one of our models. Hi, dear. Hello. Hey, hey did you have a good time or what? Oh my gosh, Kiana, you rock that black gown. Oh my yes. gosh. She's been in our hair shows before. Oh my gosh, pictures will be coming soon of the beautiful yes. Kiana. 